The screen fades into the sound of a deep metallic hum. A dark silhouette of a jet slides into the light, its shape unfamiliar, sharp, predatory, and unsettlingly beautiful. A voice rises over the echo, you're looking at something that shouldn't exist, a fighter jet built not by Lockheed Martin or Boeing, but by Honda. Yes, Honda, the same company known for Civics, Accords, and motorcycles, has done something that feels like a science fiction prank made real. The 2026 Honda HA420 fighter jet is not merely an aircraft, it's a challenge to everything we think we know about air power, technology, and the limits of imagination. Power Nation Hub takes you straight into that sky-ripping question, what happens when an automaker dares to build a warplane? Imagine engineers who spent decades perfecting quiet engines and fuel-efficient cars suddenly retuning their brains for combat performance. The HA 420's design began in secret wind tunnels, its aerodynamic form born from HondaJet's business lineage but reshaped with stealth geometry. Every contour is calculated to deflect radar waves instead of catching them. From the front it looks like a minimalist sculpture, no visible screws, no wasted edges, every millimeter serving the physics of survival. Under that sleek skin lies a twin-engine hybrid system combining next-generation turbofans with an electric assist. The idea sounds almost absurd until you realize Honda has been experimenting with hybrid propulsion for decades. Here, that obsession yields a jet that climbs faster, burns less fuel, and whispers through the sky with eerie calm. Pilots report that at low throttle, you can barely hear it pass overhead, a ghost more than a machine. The cockpit feels like stepping into the future's living room. Transparent displays overlay navigation data directly on the canopy, turning the outside world into an interactive map. No buttons crowd the panels, just gesture-sensitive surfaces and voice control so intuitive it feels alive. Honda calls the system, Synapse, and it predicts pilot decisions before they're spoken. It learns habits, adjusts responses, even modulates G-forces to keep reactions sharp during dogfights. Now, let's talk about the body itself, a fusion of carbon nanotube composites and titanium lattice frames. It's half the weight of conventional fighters yet three times more durable. Each wing flexes slightly under stress, mimicking the elasticity of a bird in motion. That flex reduces drag and keeps airflow smooth even when the aircraft pushes near Mach 2. But speed alone doesn't define the HA-420. What makes it truly shocking is its intelligence. Honda partnered with AI developers who usually design autonomous cars. They trained onboard algorithms to read radar patterns and adjust flight behavior in real time. If a missile locks on, the jet shifts its skin temperature, altering infrared signatures and confusing guidance systems. The AI doesn't just fly, it improvises. Think of it as a co-pilot that never sleeps, never panics, and never stops calculating survival probabilities. Inside Power Nation Hub's analysis, one detail stands above the rest, efficiency. Where traditional fighter jets guzzle thousands of gallons per mission, the HA-420 uses hybrid energy management that reduces consumption by almost 40%. In combat terms, that means longer patrols, less refueling, and lower radar exposure. The environment benefits too, an irony that Honda takes pride in. They call it the world's first, eco-stealth, aircraft, which sounds like an oxymoron until you remember that this is the same company that once made hybrid cars cool. When Honda first teased this jet, experts laughed. A car company can't build a warplane, they said. Yet the prototype flew flawlessly in its first demonstration, banking across the Pacific skies like a hawk reborn in carbon fiber. Test footage shows vertical takeoffs, silent glides, and a landing so smooth it looks CGI rendered. Engineers insist it's all real, no movie magic, no tricks. The fighter's most mysterious feature remains its power core control module. Instead of a standard afterburner, it channels exhaust through variable plasma vents. These vents manipulate airflow using electromagnetic fields, allowing thrust redirection without moving fins. The result, supersonic turns that defy classical aerodynamics. Watching it maneuver feels like physics taking a day off. Power Nation Hub explores the philosophy behind it. Honda believes war machines of the future will rely less on raw firepower and more on adaptability. The HA-420 carries modular payload bays, swap and surveillance pods, laser defense systems, or communication satellites within hours. In peacetime, the same frame could even serve as an emergency responder or orbital launch vehicle. Flexibility is the new armor. Then there's the question everyone asks, is it armed? Officially, 
Honda describes it as multi-mission capable. And officially, leaked blueprints hint at two internal missile bays compatible with micro-guided projectiles and one belly-mounted energy weapon prototype. Reports suggest a directed energy beam that disrupts electronics instead of causing explosions, a non-lethal dominance tool. Imagine disabling an enemy jet without firing a bullet. That's the future this aircraft whispers about. Every element of the HA-420 feels symbolic. The nose's long taper echoes Honda's logo symmetry, the tail fins sweep upward like calligraphy strokes. Even the landing gear is engineered with automotive precision, smooth hydraulic dampers derived from Formula One technology. In a sense, this fighter jet is the culmination of everything Honda has ever built. Bikes that balance themselves, cars that think, and now wings that reason. From a distance, under hangar lights, it doesn't shout power, it radiates restraint. There's something poetic about a company known for family vehicles creating a machine capable of breaking sound barriers yet doing it gracefully. Watching it taxi across a polished showroom floor feels like seeing the concept of innovation given metal in motion. But what's the bigger picture? Why would Honda venture into this territory at all? The answer lies in autonomy research. By mastering high-speed control systems and sustainable propulsion, Honda is building the blueprint for the next generation of transport, both civilian and defense. Think of the HA-420 not as a warplane but as a test bed for a new technological language, quiet, intelligent, and responsive. Power Nation Hub's report dives deeper into how global militaries reacted. The U.S. Air Force allegedly offered data-sharing agreements, Japan's Defense Ministry expressed strategic curiosity. Even private aerospace startups began studying its design. Within months, the HA-420 went from corporate oddity to global fascination. Analysts call it the Tesla moment of aviation, a disruption nobody expected from where it came. In simulation tests, the HA 420's radar cross-section was nearly one-tenth that of an F-35. Its energy efficiency beat next-generation European fighters by 30%. And when fitted with autonomous navigation, it flew complex routes through digital storms with zero pilot input. It doesn't just challenge aircraft norms, it threatens to rewrite them. Imagine a future sky where this jet doesn't just fight but communicates, where aircraft coordinate like neurons in a vast atmospheric brain. That's Honda's hidden agenda. To make aviation smarter, not louder. Each test flight is a dialogue between human intuition and machine calculation, and yet, for all its sophistication, there's a haunting simplicity to it. It's quiet when idle, graceful when turning, serene when landing. The power feels internalized, as if the jet knows it's capable of violence but chooses elegance instead. That duality, the harmony between speed and silence, captures something deeply human, progress balanced with responsibility. When Power Nation Hub's team visited Honda's aerospace facility, they described the atmosphere as almost spiritual. Engineers didn't talk about weapons, they talked about balance, sustainability, and the beauty of controlled flight. One designer even said, we're not building a fighter jet, we're building a thought experiment that can fly. That sentence lingers, a thought experiment that can fly. Maybe that's why the world is so captivated. The HA-420 represents a shift from domination to precision, from noise to nuance. It's proof that the line between art and engineering is thinner than we think. In a demo video that went viral, the jet lifts silently, hovers for a heartbeat, then vanishes into cloud layers like a trick of light. The camera shakes as it breaks the sound barrier, no roar, just a sonic sigh. Comments flood in, is this real? How did Honda do this? What's next? That sense of disbelief is part of its power. So, can it really stop anything, as rumors claim? Perhaps not yet, but symbolically, it stops doubt, it stops the assumption that innovation belongs only to the usual giants. This machine isn't about war, it's about what happens when imagination meets precision manufacturing. At Power Nation Hub, we believe stories like this remind us that technology is not fate, it's choice. Honda chose to imagine differently, and by doing so, they've drawn the blueprint for the next century's sky. Picture the last scene. A vast white hangar, the HA-420 resting under spotlight beams, its body gleaming like liquid metal. Engineers walk past, reflections rippling across the floor. The camera zooms in on the cockpit canopy, the reflection fades into sunrise clouds. A narrator's voice closes. In the end, the future doesn't arrive with thunder. It arrives quietly, on wings built by dreamers. The Power Nation Hub logo fades in. 
Music rises, calm, confident, unstoppable. The video ends, but the question lingers in the air, if Honda can build a fighter jet, what can't they build next?